hello 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 yeah I'm doing another video let's see if we have time this evening to get some of these lemon trees in that's outgrown their pots so I'm gonna plant lemon trees the same way I planted the um, miracle berry tree I'm gonna take my trusty mulch it's called no float and I put it in the bottom of my bucket to keep the soil from running out so I just cover it up about two inches high same thing I'm gonna get this up like this I will lift this but it's too heavy so let's see here so this one's done and we're gonna do this one here. We're gonna get two in today, hopefully. Let's sit this down, Michelle. Y'all don't need to see me do this cause it's simple. Okay, there you go. So both of them look about the same. We're gonna use our trusty Miracle Grow that has everything in it. But one thing I've discovered, it does compact from time to time. So you're gonna need to add some perlite and I do add a little couple of other things to it. So this bag is done. So let me break this up because it's got some clumps, kind of clumpy in there. And Got my scissors. Opening this up. I'm just gonna tear that the rest of the way. And pouring this in. And then I'm gonna pour this in here. This, this one right here. Okay. So that took care of that bag. I'm gonna do just like I did before. I'm gonna add some perlite. The perlite allows for drainage, okay? And you want it to drain. Put a fourth of a bag in there, fourth of a bag in here. And come back over here, back over here. Move a little bit for on top. I'm getting ready to go down in here and mix this up. How about that? And because that soil, some of it was kind of wet, I'm making sure I break up anything that's clumpy and what have you. Because it was kind of damp. But you want to mix the perlite in there really good. And this is what it's going to look like. And we're going to add something else in here. Go ahead and do this side over here. I want it to look just like the other one. And when your soil is wet like that, to keep it from clumping up, you just, as you mix it, it's like you're doing some dough. You just keep moving your hands to break it up and mix that perlite up in there really good. Cause you don't want them roots to sit in anything wet. You want the moisture to keep going on through. Let it sit in there long enough for those roots to take the moisture up and the moisture need to keep on going. You don't need to be making no pit stops. Yeah, so I'm mixing it up real good. I am so far behind y'all. I got to show you the garden though. Cause I've been putting out some vegetables. I didn't have time to videotape because I wasn't supposed to be out here. <laughs> so, you know, you do a little bit and then you can run your little tail on back on the inside. Okay, so that was done good. We are gonna take some of this frog Forgotten the whole name of it, but y'all know what it is. It's got a lot of good stuff in it. I'm gonna put that in there. This in here. And we're gonna mix that up real good. It's okay. I know it loves a lot of acid, but it's gonna get it from what I put in here. But because this is um lip lime, look at these lemons. I am going to add some peat moss. Oh, yeah, did I bring the peat moss? 
got the perlite. Did I forget the peat moss? Put y'all on hold. I'll go get the peat moss. I got it around here somewhere. So we're going to mix this up real good. I'll be right back. Okay, I decided to bring y'all on back in here. The uh, I added another bag of potting mix from the, the citrus palm and the cactus palm and citrus potting mix. I think that's gonna be enough, but we'll see. But anyhow, we're going ahead and let me just mix some of this in right here. And we're doing two, that's why it's taking a minute. Y'all have to realize it takes a minute when you're doing two, but you're killing two birds with one stone. Two birds with one stone, yes we are. So, let's take a look, see. See, this is turning yellow. Let me take it around so you can see it. So, it's not supposed to be turning yellow. This is a Meyer lemon. It is, uh, this is the improved Meyer lemon. So let's see what we have going on. Oh my God. Yeah, look at those roots circling. They having a good party. We're gonna break that up just a little bit. Not much. Just let it know it can go on ahead and stretch itself out. And then, we're going to uh, see how much we need. I'm gonna take some out. Cause you wanna leave about a one and a half to two inch lip at the top so you can put your soil at the top. I'm mean, not your soil, but your mulch up there. And um, you don't want the water to run off when you water it. So that looked like it's sitting, let's see. Yeah, that's perfect. But I'm seeing how it's looking a little lump side. I want it to sit up. So I'm going to push some soil underneath it to make it sit like I want it to sit. And then go on and pack this soil in around it. Let's see here. Yeah. And me make sure I have it like I want it. You know, I'm going to bring it up a little bit higher. Just a little bit. Just a little bit higher. Yeah. I don't like for my uh, connection with my root and scion to be too low. See, that brings it up a little higher. Yeah, that's perfect. So I'm gonna pack this in, making sure my time is still good. I'm gonna use some of the soil in this bucket over here. Then I worry about this bucket later. And this is this is gonna have to have, because it's turning yellow, I give it some uh, Epsom salt. I give it some sodium magnesium. Basically, it just needs some, some elements. And this, tag is on here too tight so it's already girdling when you see that happening take the tag off we know what it is so we're gonna take the tag off and we're just gonna keep filling this in until it fills up let me use both hands because this should not be turning yellow that's not a good sign but there's nothing to worry about i think the sudden change in temperature caused it to drop so and that's okay we okay I'm gonna pack this down around the sides. So we keep on doing this. And uh, we have us a new lemon tree. And she's gonna like being in here. She has more nutrition this way, okay? So we have a new my lemon tree. We're gonna water her in so that she know that she can drink as much as she wants to. I may give her some nutrition today. I may wait till tomorrow. Give her something liquid, a liquid nutritional citrus drink. And I guarantee you, I'll bring it back and let you see what she looked like. She gonna look like a new lady. Oops, sorry y'all. Didn't mean to slap you in the face, y'all okay? Y'all know how I am. Told you I'm heavy handed. So we're going to put her on the ground. And we'll look at the next one that we're going to do. Who's going to be our next baby? I think we ought to do a live. What y'all think? I'm going to bring y'all back for the lamb. How about that? Hold on. This is the lime. This is a thornless key lime. I like anything thornless. So 
I'm going to get some more soil so we can make sure she has the same treatment. So, we're going to do that next time. Y'all take care. Love you. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification button. Doesn't cause you anything. Just to press the button. And we'll talk to you at the next live. Well, this is not a live. The next planning. Bye.